what's up <clears throat> this is 1028 awakenings and i'm back again with another motherfucking video what's up y'all what's good what's going on i'm wearing purple today okay <laughs> i know it's like what the hell are you wearing but you know sometimes you have to wear the colors of um the rainbow okay and it really does brighten up your spirit and change your vibration when you wear different colors okay i'm a very colorful person okay so if you want a personal reading with me guys you can get all of that information in the description box below hey to all my new subscribers what's up how y'all doing you know how we do sit back chill and let's have a good time okay um also follow me on 1028 weekends it is wise for you to do that especially if you want a discount or you want to just damn shit a free reading okay so it's wise for you to follow me at 1020 awakenings on my you on my instagram page i go live pretty much almost every day i will be going live today as well okay and i give discounts and free readings sometimes and if i get new cards um i just give out free readings with the new cards that i receive okay all right y'all so check out blending cultures um that's my daughter's brand we have mommy and me collection books games puzzles you name it we got it all right there's also an amazon link down there and in that amazon link you'll see all the books that i've ever published go ahead and check them out okay this is my notebook journal this is the masculine copy all right it is on back order right now so it should be available soon it is really cool it's like a little journal that i made you write in it i write in it we both exchange stories it's really really cool um i really love this book okay i have it in masculine this is the masculine copy and i have it in feminine as well okay and that's on amazon in the link description box below okay so let's see let's see all right, so we got zeros, okay? If y'all don't know about the infamous zeros, now you about to get talked, okay? So let's go ahead into the school 101, okay? Zeros is all about like, um, it's not like the infinity sign, but it's like new beginnings, everything new, you know what I'm saying? But a lot of shit had to like die, okay? In order for this new stuff to come in, okay? I am a creator, so it's like starting from zero, okay? Like in the beginning, there was dust and then he made clay and all that shit. This is basically where you are right now, okay? Collective, okay? You are the one, you are one with the creator and there's no limits to what you can achieve. You have the ability to create something new and incredible in your lifetime here and now. I am the creator, okay? So that's a really good place to be, okay? You're at a blank canvas, okay? And in order for you to really co-create, like I said before, today is a new moon. I didn't say that before, but I said it in another video. Um, today is a good day for you to release what no longer serves you. And then it's a really good day to bring in what you want to come, the new, the co-creator, okay? All right, so let's see what crystals you need if this reading resonates with you. I ain't mad at ya. All right, so somebody might be mad at somebody. I ain't mad at ya. All right, so this crystal, who needs it? Explore searching for a fountain of youth. Grow with your heart, okay? So if it's time for you to grow with your heart, all right? Um, you know, remind yourself of like when you used to just keep the shit, have a good time, you know, relax. It wasn't so damn uptight and worried about shit. Always snapping on somebody because they laughing and playing like, Somebody be cussing out their kids like, damn, y'all play too much just because they happy? Your ass ain't happy, so you mad. Everybody got to be mad. Okay, I ain't trying to beat you up, but I'm just saying, them kids happy. That's why they out there having a good time. You might need to be happy too, okay? All right. Okay, so now that we done with the crystals, all right, I got some new cards. Big up to the Divine Goddess Oracle, but I'm just going to use it for everybody, okay? But I really love it. Look at that shit. I like that rose gold shimmer. Something about that rose gold. Just get me excited, okay? All right, spirit guides and ancestors, we come before you now for a clear message for the collective. What's going on with the collective? I'm trying to do some collective reads, okay? All right, so somebody was... Okay, so somebody just opened up to you, all right? Somebody just confessed to you. They released a secret, okay? Um, mm -hmm. Somebody was just honest, okay? Somebody was just honest with you, Collective, and they just dropped a bomb. I'm here and dropped a bomb on you, okay? So let's see what the hell they was honest with you about. Damn, okay? Damn, somebody just, somebody just came and confessed something. So let me be nosy. What somebody came and confessed, Okay. No. Hmm. 
They haven't. It's collective. Somebody did not come and tell you a secret. No, Spirit is telling me. No, Ashley, somebody did not release a secret. <laughs> Spirit said, you need to go show them. I'm like, no, not show them the secret. I thought they already knew. Spirit said, nah, bitch. This person didn't say it. No, say it ain't so. Okay, look. All right, so look, collective. This person didn't come and confess something to you. All right, we finna go to the sexual tarot. All right, let's see what they didn't confess. All right, damn. Damn, I was like, okay. Now I get to prove. They was like, oh, this person didn't tell anything. <laughs> I'm like, okay. All right, so somebody didn't tell you something. Ooh, somebody didn't tell you something. They had put you in a third-party situation, okay? Ooh, Lord. Oh, no. Look at this picture, y'all. I ain't never seen this, Terrell. I got to take it to the emperor. Okay, all right, all right. Now I get it. Okay, so this emperor okay could be a father a baby daddy a leader someone in the community all right someone who is um a father i already said that okay but they're in reverse so they're immature they may not be a good dad okay um they they're they don't exude uh, you know, attributes as a good leader or emperor, but they may be a father. I mean, they may be a father that gave life, but they're not a dad. They're not active every day. Now, this person from my collective, they were supposed to come tell you a secret that they were hiding, okay? Um, and they were supposed to come clean about it, but they didn't. They acted immature. They may have ghosted you. They may have left you collective, okay? But this person was um, lying, okay? They may have put you in a third-party situation, okay? The higher friend could have been marriage, okay? So this person could have been married, all right? They could have had an open relationship in this marriage, okay? Or this um, emperor or this immature male, okay? It could be a female. could be an immature female. She could have been married, okay? It goes both ways. Um, but anyway, the point is they were cheating on you with multiple women, all right? Or multiple men, all right? And they were probably married because the hierophant is like a higher level of commitment or they were in a relationship, okay? So, damn, okay? So, somebody was supposed to come and come clean with you to tell you that they was juggling your motherfucking ass, but they didn't. They ghosted you. They acted very immature about it, okay? They was definitely juggling you with two other women or two other men, okay? Ooh, Spirit said this the truth. God damn, bruh. <laughs> Look, so Spirit said that's the truth. Okay, so let's see. All right, let's see. Spirit, what else you got to tell us, okay? So you having a real hard time releasing this situation, okay? Um, because it's a real heavy wound, okay? And uh, the feelings are very, very healthy. Um, it says release wounds, pent up feelings through healthy activities in reverse, okay? So you guys are not doing that, okay? You're not releasing this situation. You feel like this cut really deep, you know? You're really hurt by this betrayal um, that this person did. This person definitely is married. They should have confessed this to you, but they did not, okay? They acted immature. This could be an emperor energy. They acted immature. They were cowardly. You know, maybe some of these people even ghosted you, but this person is married, and this person did put you in a third-party situation, okay? But for my collective, you guys are having a really Really hard time releasing this situation okay damn y'all okay so spirit said it's time for you guys to roll out you know roll out you know leave this situation alone just go ahead and walk away from it okay spirit what else do you want to tell us about this situation I'm sorry, y'all. Okay, so they're going to be calling you, okay? Call me, all right? Somebody got to talk to you, all right? So somebody's going to be calling you, probably this person, and they're going to be expressing that they love you and they care about you and they're thinking about you, um, but they're really just coming in. They're really just... Um, they're coming in to tell you that they, I don't really feel like they're coming to tell you the confession, okay? This is something that's hidden from you, uh, crown of your read, confession in reverse. But they may be coming in after a long time of silence, just like, hey, you know, I love you, I want to be with you, I'm sorry for my behavior, but this is why they left, okay? They definitely are married, they're definitely putting you in a third party situation, and now you're in that energy where you're just kind of focused on yourself collective, you like, fuck that shit, I'm focused on myself, I just want to focus on my self-worth. And you've been healing since this person's been gone, okay? Since you've been gone. All right, so somebody has been healing. 
And I feel like it's my collective. You went in, you did the shadow work, you've been focusing on yourself. Some of you guys started a new business when you went in, okay? Some of you guys was fucked up, okay? Some of you guys was fucked up for at least three weeks straight, all right? I'm sorry, y'all. I can feel it, okay? Some of y'all was fucked up, okay? This separation was real for you, okay? And some of you guys felt like you was not enough, okay? You like, damn, why would somebody just ghost me like that? Why would somebody just do that? Like, I know I'm the truth. You was checking yourself, bitch. Y'all was out here talking to yourselves, okay? And Spirit is saying, yeah, you the truth, okay? You are an individual. You put your individual stamp on this situation, but this person had, this person was married, okay? This person was in a committed relationship and you didn't know that. Now, you felt like this love may have been unconditional, okay? But Spirit is saying, uh-uh, you had to put that in yourself, okay? That self-love was unconditional. So you had to learn a lesson about self-love, okay? And you guys broke up. You separated, okay? You stopped this pattern. You stopped this silent treatment. This nigga abandoned you or this female abandoned you, just dropped off the face of the planet. And it's because this person was married and had commitments elsewhere, okay? That's why this person left like that. But now you're like, you know what? This separation really healed me. You went in, you did some shadow work you healed yourself okay but you was fucked up though i ain't gonna lie i can feel it you was fucked up but it's okay because you realize that you are enough that this person is very immature some of you guys found out this person had kids okay because this is the emperor energy in reverse so this person got kids and don't take care of them okay this person got a lot of shit going on and they don't take care of them okay and then they act like they're this husband or this wife or they're this this or they're this that but in all actuality they just a player okay there's somebody who don't even want to be in a committed relationship with who they're with, okay? That's crazy, all right? All right, let's see what else is going on, all right? Let's see what else is going on, collective. What else, spirit? What else we need to know about this situation, okay? All right, so yeah, this person does not take responsibility for their kids, okay? And also, even if it's the mom, y'all, this person don't take responsibility for her kids. She just leave her kids with people, okay? And if it's a male, they don't even act like, like you don't automatic, you don't automatically know when you meet the person that they got kids because they're not even proud of their kids because they don't do shit with this person, okay? They don't do shit with their own kid. Now, also, I want to say, this particular emperor energy in reverse could be a male or a female they act very childish instead of you know stepping up to the plate and doing what they got to do they childish as fuck okay they very immature all right you and this person may have went on trips together okay you and this person may have went through a very great stage where you guys was like ecstasy y'all was happy y'all was in love you know it was a bliss but that shit came to an end because you started to really see this person's character and you realize this person did not even have integrity this person didn't even love themselves okay when you deny your kids you know that's kind of weird okay all right but this person is now seeing signs and synchronicities all right so you may have been the spiritual person in this connection okay and you might have been telling them about 111 222 shit that was going on with you and shit like that and they was like oh okay cool that's cool all right but then after the time went past and you guys separated from each other um you then started to go within okay you started to focus on yourself then you realize like you ain't need this person this person was a dead weight this person was a lesson okay and you passed it all right and that was very beautiful now when you left this person guess what happened a train a chain reaction this person now is starting to see two 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 and five 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 and spirit and their ancestors and their guys are now communicating and talking to them and now they realize like they may have picked like all this childish energy over somebody that could have been a fucking earth angels and them a straight up blessing okay so now they're in a lot of regret all right so let's see how they really feel let's see how they really feel damn this is deep <laughs> let's see how they really feel y'all all right spirit got something in here all right let's see how this real person really feel spirit guides and ancestors we come before you now we want a clear message to see how this distorted emperor really feels all right i don't want to let you down all right so this distorted emperor energy does not want to let you down okay they really want to be with you they want to try again they feel like they really fumbled a ball on something that could have been promising but at the time when they met you collected they weren't in a good place okay they weren't in a good place and they were at a place where there was no love where they were. They were married or they were in a commitment and there was no love so they were like messing around with people 
you know, because they were just empty. But then collective, when they bumped into you, it was instant love, okay? And they thought it wasn't. That's why they left you and went to some back to the marriage or back to just hopping around. But they realized they were looking for all of these people. Everything that you exuded to this person, all the traits that you had, they were looking for it in all these other people, okay? Because you were the one that walked away, okay? I strongly feel like you just dipped out on this person. Even though they ghosted you, you didn't go, like, running after them. You just was like, okay, you know? And now this person is looking for you and all these other people and they just realize like they really fucked up okay will you ever make things right okay so look they're saying like dang are you gonna reach out even though i fucked up are you not gonna just see if i'm straight and you like nah <laughs> like i mean i'm okay like you do your thing you feel what i'm saying and they're like what okay so this person is used to people cheat um chasing them okay but they really want you badly okay they think about you a lot let's see what kind of thoughts they thinking shit let's find out the tea okay so let's see they want you badly spirit guides and ancestors let's see how they want you okay all right oh lord okay so this person is the devil all right that's scorpionic energy okay i don't really feel i feel like spirit is saying this is over however they want you i don't think you should uh, want to go that way okay uh but we're gonna still dig it in there okay because the devil is all about scorpion energy okay it could turn into a drastic obsession that's what i'm feeling for you guys okay so this person has a drastic obsession with you okay all right let's see how they want you they said they want you badly spirit said it's demonic okay what they want all right mm-hmm everything in reverse okay so they really want to touch you and they want to go slow but they want to bite you so much that you'll bleed okay all right and they want to pleasure you as well they want to watch you pleasure yourself okay in reverse they like some twisted stuff okay so for my collective this person wants you badly to the point where it's turning into an obsession every card is in reverse so that means that they they want to touch you sexually this image is very sexual but they want to bite you to the point where you bleed okay and they drink the blood it's demonic okay it's demonic energy all right so you might have to leave this one mm -hmm, these in reverse too okay but they look at you as the empress dang they look at you as someone who is a magical creature they look at you as someone who manifests their dreams and their desires they look at you as somebody who is gorgeous who is handsome who smells good looks good body is amazing okay they look at you as their wish fulfillment damn this person is gonna always lust after you you are you collective you is this person's lesson this is beautiful okay this person just want to be with you all right this person wants to have a happy ever after with you but they feel like they're not going to be able to have a chance to do that so they just fantasize about you but they look at you as a wish fulfillment damn wow this is beautiful all right we're gonna have to name this the one that got away all right guys the empress card i'll see you guys next time bye